to chip one in a little nine iron shot well, who does it find looks like Dacos there yeah see the guy is so complete you know he's, he's a giant in the air he's got great balance and agility and also his, his ground skills and short kicking are, are fantastic he's, a, he's got a very very good football brain that player okay Peter Dacos has his chance to put his first on the scoreboard almost running out of time nine kicks for Dacos so far in the game Dacos's kick doesn't look too bad that split the woodwork that's goal number 19 Gets clear at the Nevin, shoots, and a mark for sure. He comes back, plays on, gets the hand pass out over the top of Dacos. <laughs> and a goal! The Macedonian Marvel has done it again. Tony Shaw inside 50, plays on, he's gone for a pass, but Dacos will march in the pocket. Dacos, as you can see, on a fairly acute angle, he was looking to get around pretty quickly, but was covered. Doing all the attacking for the Rippets though, and still only got the one goal. Dacos, 20 metres out. Close. Goal on fire says four points, Collingwood second. Harwick, a little bit of space, he likes it like that, don't bow it. Out wide, half forward flank, Matty Ryan, he gets past Blakey, head past the hook. We've got players that support Dacos, simple shot, goal, Collingwood. Well, Peter Dacos in on the end of some good play. Christian get the ball out of the centre with this kick from Manson. Bobbles it towards half forward. He was there. He hit the table on the chest. In fact, it did It surprised him because he couldn't hold the mark. Free kick. Going Collingwood's way. He doesn't look too good. This is the way Peter Dacos started last week. He started in the centre. We see here on replay, he's run into the biggest man on the ground at 17 stone 10, Aunt John Ironmonger. Oh, didn't he? Oh, he ran into it. It would be like running into a brick wall. Here's Gary Dacos two so far from 45. Back at three. Hollywood back in front. To Manson, he's trying to draw a man. That was the reason why to give it to Brown to Dacos. Now Dacos can run at the heart of this Eagles defence. Dacos is inside 50. Goal coming up for Collingwood. Great kick. Great goal. That high, really to Doritich's favour. Doritich gets the thump away. Taylor's back there again. Now there's a chance for Dacos. Poor tackle by Elvin. It's got to be a free kick all over the top of Peter Dacos. And Dacos has got the ball. It's about. 35 metres from goal. Here it is here. It's Taylor going past that actually connects with Dacos. Yeah. And then as it Dacos falls from the tackle, uh, Alvin went to grab him and there was nothing there. So he put the saddle on him. Well, it's, uh, it's an interesting distance for Peter Dacos. Shot for goal. Straight over the goal and fires head. Collingwood goal. 27, there are sure to be many outstanding games yet to be played by this exquisitely skilled magpie. Been moved on to Stasevich. In the forward pocket, boundary throw in. Chance now for Banks, over the top. Dacos. Left foot shot for goal. He's good. Banks now, on the run. Taylor at the back with a set. Collingwood's 50, picked up by Elshaw. He's kicked to Dacos, being grabbed or held by one hand. Dacos might make amends. He picks it up and kicks it off his left boot, and he's put it through for Collingwood's ninth goal. Towards half forward. Now, this is the brilliant Dacos with a quick kick. I think he might have put it through, Peter Dacos. He has. Gibson, he does so. Long towards the 50-metre line. At the back is right. Quickly to Dacos. He pulls it back, and he has put it through. 
draws a man, goes to Brown. Brown short to Dacos. Can he get there? Yes, he can. He had to check. But he's taken this mark about 35 metres out from goal at a 45 degree angle. And it should be an enthralling duel. Peter Dacos to put the Magpies in front. And into the breeze. That'll be a good effort. What a kick by Dacos. Might be Collingwood's first score. Taylor Goodyear's at the body, almost took the mark against Silvani. Plays on, looks for a hand pass, no backup support. Banks ultimately has to run to the boundary line. They won't call it a centering kick, but Dacos has marked on an angle about 25 metres out. I wonder if it was intentional. It'd be interesting to see it on replay because he realised he couldn't kick it. Should be Collingwood's first score. He's got it. It's a goal. Asovic getting the front position, we'll look for Tony Shaw, finds him, standing start kick, up to the square, Dacos is there, should be a goal to Collingwood, and Dacos makes no mistake. Dave in a pack, big flies, Ryan picks up the crumbs out to Dacos, Dacos skillfully eludes, two, then on the left foot, thank you very much, great goal to Peter Dacos. They got us uh, to boundary throw in, Cloak and Deer again. No one with the tap. The ball's pushed back in towards the middle. Dacos, one goal. Thank you very much, says Peter Dacos. Yes. Top player for Collingwood last year. And, uh, well, the short one is on. And very poor marking that by poor form defence. By the veteran, too, Michael Tuck, playing on Peter Dacos. Well, Dacos. The two skippers playing on each other, Peter. Yep, and a uh, bit of talent there. One in, in his prime, I'd say, Dacos and Michael Tuck. Nearing the end of his career, but still a valuable player. Shouldn't miss this. And he does it. Straight through the centre, another one to Collingwood. Just on time on, Collingwood hit the front for the first time. But a goal to Graham Wright and another to the masterful Peter Dacos just before three-quarter time brought Collingwood back into the game. Looking for Taylor. Shepard! Young Heath Shepard has had a couple of marvellous weeks. He goes to Dacos in the pocket. And here's a fine goal. Marks, it's been a fine effort as Kerrison tumbles Collingwood forward again. The bounce for Kelly is not good. Straight down to Dacos. He shoots. Will Campbell get there? I don't think so. It's another one. Even stretch. Can he keep it in play? Dacos comes down, gets taken off the football. And will be free kick. Another 50 with a stretch going on with it and kicking the ball away. So the Dacos kick one goal in the third quarter. He's added to that. That's number two. Can on to Brian Taylor. Oh, he's 60 metres out. Runs his full distance. Goes in towards full forward. Hocking at the back to affect the spoil. Waiting down. Dacos. Good combination, the brilliant Dacos, roving the pack well, and finished over the top to Morwood, into Barwick, now Dacos, he won't miss this one, or will he? No, he won't, it's a goal. So Dacos has been magnificent in this quarter, and good combination, Brownless being brought back on the ground, but Mullane and Dacos, particularly in this quarter, have lifted the Collingwood side. Dacos, 10 kicks and 5 handballs this quarter. Yes, it's been magnificent. Good combination there by Collingwood, bringing the ball into the forward line. Uh, da Dacos kicking that one off the outside of the boot. The old banana kick from Peter Dacos. Not too many players near Mullane who can go long. He'll be looking for Taylor. Dacos is down there. Oh, takes a brilliant mark. Plays on that. Might have been touched off the boot. It wasn't. It's a goal. And McQuan is 55 metres out. He's gone for a short pass. Now we're getting down to some sharp shooters as Dacos leads up the ground and takes it in a ten and a half forward, 40 metres out from goal. Give time to line up. This will be his 303rd goal in league football if he gets it. Comes in. Fires towards goal. And it was going to the left, but it's got through before it did go over to the left. 
It's another one on the board to the Magpies, and there's the call as Tottenham runs his full 10 metres, gets the kick away over towards the forward line where Tony Shaw's running down. He taps it over towards Dacos. Dacos makes room for himself as only Dacos can, and then he fires into the open goal. This is going close, and all that uh, Lees can do is run in and watch it bounce through. Dacos magic there to finish it off with a brilliant goal, and Colling... At Remember, Banks, short kick. Will Bayless get there? Excellent attempt to soccer it away, and he's kept it in play. Fine stuff. And by Ryan Sauls has found a free kick. Holding the man, he says. He decides to run around. Dacos kicks and goals. Two goals in the first. That was a very, very smart goal then by Peter Dacos. He was deep. At half forward, back to Dacos. Oh, great effort by Dacos to get away up towards uh, half forward. Chance now for Paul Tudnam against Longmire. Dacos is there also. It's tapped away straight to Longmire. The dangerous Dacos in after it. Now by said he was tripped. He was legged on that occasion. Got it over the bend. You know. oh, Dacos wants to short pass this. Now he's going for the torpedo. Pat, oh, look at that. Well, that is the value of the old torpedo punt. When you're distance from goal, you go with it. It always covers the distance better than the drop punt. And he's been missing since half time. Barwick's kick to half forward for Collingwood. Dacos got a hand to it, couldn't complete the mark. Manson goes down. We'll look for a tap on. Try to get it to Dacos, which he does. Dacos chased by Hannah inside 50. Hooks it across. Going goalwards. Looks good. And through. Down goes Schwab, brilliantly picked up by Shepard, gets it across to Monkhurst, the two youngsters combining, Dacos, the veteran, on the end of the kick. That was good play by Shepard, once again, he set one up earlier in the game, in the first quarter, and got it across to Barwick. On that occasion too, he went in after the ball, got it quickly across to Monkhurst. And Dacos gets the goal as a result. Deceptive player, Monkhurst, he always manages to get his kicker his handball despite the opposition. I think he's going to... At the back is Manson. Big fellow does well. Looks for a hand pass, a wild one at that, certainly. Dacos found some space. Long shot at goal. He's shepherded through by McEwen for four points. Again, great turnaround by Collingwood. Here they come again. That's Keyes to Hawk. Jamie Turner, great tackle, but he gets in the hand pass. Arisa Larkas again in there after it. Alexander drops it. Could have been holding the ball. Here's the brilliant Dacos. An open goal. Has put it through. Kicked away from him by Schultz right out wide. Bearstow and Mullane. Mullane quick to recover. Good play, Darren Mullane. Kicks it straight up in the air towards half forward. Jamie Turner underneath it. Oh, a lot of courage shown there. Stasovic to Dacos. Dacos kicks. Too late, Shaw. Monkhurst. Oh, dummies well for a big fellow. Did it twice. Long kick. Risa Larkas should have marked it. Dacos will kick a goal. Couple of bounces if he wants to. Draws a man short. Uh, got the hand pass away to Robertson, which wasn't a good one. And often those runs down a boundary line can come unstuck. Your forwards just don't know when you're going to kick a Robertson strength to Dacos. Can he get clear? Gets short fronted. He's kicked the goal anyway. Brown. Great play, Gavin Brown. Let's see if they can capitalise this time. Taylor, Kernahan. They fight through it again. There's Dacos, the brilliant Dacos. Picks it up and puts it through. What? Tottenham again. Boot the ball very quickly from a standing start. Looking for Taylor. Dacos robes it beautifully. Oh, like Kevin Bartlett at his best and goals. Madden. Shuffled out of it. There's Dacos. Manson in after the umpire's found a free kick this time in the pack. It's going to Dacos. They want this, Collingwood. Peter Dacos from 35 metres, normally a great kick, and that looks good. It's a goal. Swings it back to centre it. No mark taken. Dacos lurks. Claims a good tackle on Blackwell. Out the back door to Mullane it goes. Wide to Tudnam. Is this another one? Sets up the hand pass to Dacos. Steadies. Shoots and goes.
Here's Kelly. Brown running with him. Kelly goes long. Floating it up towards full forward. Alvin couldn't take it. Chance for Dacos. Shoots and goes. What a start. He's kicked it wide. He's got Manson on the lead. Oh, he's got a loose man ducking back to Manson. Oh, oh he's got it. Great play by the big man. He straightens up. Fires. And the mark has been taken by Dacos. I think Jesselinko made a bad move. Take well, Dacos has got the ball. He's a clever player. I'd back him for a goal here for sure. He'll run out to the right. I, he'll do something magical. Yes, out to the right. Hook it back. Has he put it through? Yes, it's a goal to the Magpies. Lane, long and low, in towards full forward, over the top of Alvin. Past Manson, on to Doherty. His hand pass is smothered. Manson comes in over the top. Bowie, clear. Dacos, goal. Thanks. He's come into it since Silmani's moved off him. There's Barwick. Sets it up for his forwards. Doritic taps the ground. Tottenham. An open goal. Beautiful hand pass to Dacos. Goal number six coming up for Dacos. He's put it through, I feel. Yes, he has. Short to half forward. It's fisted the ground. Banks off the ground. He's enjoyed Silvani being moved off him as he kicks it up to Dacos. Dacos against Tom Elvin. Dacos under the left foot. Is this a miraculous goal? A brilliant effort by Dacos. Goal number seven. There's backwards to Healy, who's caught. Good handball by Tudman. Brown couldn't quite get it across to Barwick. Right. Handball. Dacos. Is this a goal to Dacos? Loves kicking them. Barwick running with the ball. Barwick gets past. Left foot snap. It's a little chip. It's good. Disciplined stuff. And Dacos takes the mark. Unselfish play. Unselfish play there by Barwick. And Dacos should goal, he does. So Dacos kicks his second. The pace. Drop punt. Standing his ground, Carroll. Dacos. Barwick. Can he get it to Manson in the goal square? Round his body. Oh, nearly a beauty to my shepherd. Off the ground, Dacos. And don't they love it? Their champion scores like Palais. Oh, Leon's been picked up. The free kick is going the way of Collingwood. Down towards centre half forward. A fine attempt to mark. It's not going to be paid to Barwick. Manson gets it to Dacos. Dacos goes into the open goal, and that'll be the leveller. There's been a, a holding incident up at full forward. Umpire Coates has picked up that Hanaberry was holding Dacos. So Dacos has got the free kick 30 metres from goal directly in front. Peter Dacos, who has kicked one goal. Richardson has kicked Collingwood's other goal. Dacos has now kicked two goals. Coll Christian's kicked towards half forward. Barwick leads his opponent, Eppleston, under the ball. Reynolds, kick off the ground by Richardson. Dacos, is this goal number three? Yes, sir. Re Peter Dacos. Inside 50 or on the 50 metre line. He bends it back for Dacos. He'll have a shot in the pocket. Great play. With a southeasterly breeze, he'll have to start this towards the right goalpost and bring it back. Exactly like that. Not a problem. Four goals to Dacos. The make round initially, Collingwood. Krasiska, just outside 50, goes short, waiting there, all alone. P. Dacos. Well, he's going to be kicking from 45 metres. He has kicked four, three of those in the first quarter, and one in the second. And again, percentage, Sandy. Yep. Only five kicks and four hand passes. Five right, kicks for four goals. This is another one. That's another one. Make that five goals to Dacos. Down towards half forward, Mark Williams. Sits over it, almost lost it. Tuttenham gets the hand pass away. He was looking for Dacos, who was held, and will kick for number six. Dacos really didn't have control of the footy. He was never, ever going to take control of it. 
and the player just held him up ever so slightly. Well, he's kicking from the identical spot he booted his last, and that is an identical result. Goal number six. Now a chance for Rice to get it wider to Hardy. The handball is not a good one. Tudman, the opportunist, to Dacos. 30 metres out. He steadies. Shoots. He goes. What a feeling out there, Sandy, as we see Kane Taylor. Krasiska goes over the top to Barwick. His claim starts of it on the Dacos. Dacos steadies. And he goes. Second goal to Dacos. Comes off to Brown. He's kicked the centre half forward. Thumped on by Christian. Well done, Barwick to Dacos. Goal for Peter Dacos. But it finishes up with Wright, who has slashed them to pieces in this quarter. Through Dacos it goes. Mightn't be bad for the team. Persistent to Dacos. Dacos for goal. And the pass are in front. Through. Russell, clever hand pass out to Stasevich. Dacos has got it. Dacos. 40 metres out directly in front. But he's kicking into a very strong breeze. Started with a hit out from Manson. This to pull it back to two points. Just over three minutes remaining and the clock is running down. The champ goes Goldwood. It hangs in the breeze. It's good. Goal to Collingwood. Can't quite hang on, but Brown supports him. Gives a lovely hand pass to Dacos, who can line them up from 25 out and drills it. That's the play of the day. Kicks to within about 30 metres out from goal. Iron Munger up, can't get the second grab. In front of the pack, raving it beautifully. Dacos swings onto his left boot, kicks in towards goal and has put it through. Probably would get uh, the equal. Kicks long to half forward. Iron Munger and Pert flew high. Couldn't take the mark though after getting up there and doing everything right. And penalised for holding the ball after coming down with it and not getting it out. Dacos takes the free, 75 metres, oh, oh, mighty torpedo, he's goal! A magnificent kick, he was 75 out, I called it, and he leant back and he gave that torpedo everything, including perfect timing, and gets his third. He's coming with 50, Russell picks it up, little kick in towards full forward, Dacos is there, they go to ground, Dacos might seal it here, picks it up, and he has put it through! Dacos from 20 metres out, to drive them into attack again. Russell looking for Dacos on the half forward line and he, oh beautiful Mark Dacos. 40 metres out, almost directly in front to give Collingwood a 21 point advantage. Goal number five for Dacos, he puts it through. They've really had no trouble finding the uh, major opening since uh, just after half time. Kicked that fantastic banana goal a short time ago. He goes towards Brown's lead, it doesn't reach him. Off the pack, Dacos, left foot snap for number six. <laughs> I haven't seen him play a more influential game of football. He's kicked... Still spilling out. A chance for Angus to come in there and other players. North Melbourne eventually trying to rest themselves there. And there's a free kick for holding the ball. Uh, it'll go to Collingwood and be taken over there by Dacos in the forward pocket. He won or attempt to mark a moment or two ago as a chance for him to atone. It'll be a banana kick. It is a banana kick and it's gone through for a goal. So that squares the ledger as far as the marvel is concerned. And Collingwood goal. Who bounces. He's got Mullane inside. Mullane hand passes further afield. Who's this? Krasiska. Over the top to Dacos. Dacos runs into an open goal. the way they're teaming together they ran on the ball so too does russell they got it out to jamie turner to set a half forward dacos takes a brilliant mark runs away from chandler here's another one mr magic at his best three goals dacos superb control of the football and he threads his way through the center of the ground being called on and gets the boot to the ball kicking towards the forward line and he's found dacos so that was pretty good football by life by right 45 metres out, the angle's scarcely worth mentioning. Dacos coming in now to put it on its way and it's swinging back nicely for a goal and that's the pattern, uh, as we mentioned, the pattern one reply and that's the four goals for Dacos. Four goals. Happening known yet. Over the top came Stacevic, stumped at a mile. It burst in towards 30 metres of the goal and Dacos has pinched the footy. He lines it up and has put through the most unbelievable goal you've ever seen. I can tell you now, Houdini eats your heart out. Ron, how did he get that? 
Wow. And Manson has sprinted away from Fairley. Unbelievable. Dacos can't take the mark. Chandler puts pressure on Mr. Magic. He picks it up. Dacos, he's in position. He's weaving his way through. How did he get through there? I don't know. It's a goal. You have to see that to believe it. Unbelievable stuff by Mr. Mate, Mr. Magic Dacos. Collingwood, a quick hand pass a further afield. We'll find Tudman and he spurts away. On the 50 metre line, he lets fly for goal. Dacos is marked in the goal square and just ambles in and pops through another goal. Now it's going to be a brave man to say uh, there's better player on the ground than Dacos. Drop punt to the goal front. Monkhurst. Cameron. Dacos, this will be a goal. Watch this. Bang, through. Foffer. Collingwood have got numbers all over the place. The kick by Gaifer, nearly marked there by Stasevich, picked up by Dacos, it'll roll through, it's a goal. Brilliant kick by Dacos. Been just great all day. Charges with a little one, Dacos. So the that's Macedonian typical, Marvel. Bruce. The fact that Glenn Lovett bounced off, uh, he paddled the ball forward, bounced off at Collingwood. Then Lovett curled in between, the ball came over and then to McGuan and then McGuan spots Dacos. Everything just running Collingwood's way. Well he's kicked 37 goals so far this season, drop punt. Good kick. Right with pace and power, attacks the goal front, what a kick. It was superb. Gee, that was exciting. McGuan to right who just exploded away, saw Dacos and rammed it down his belly. And Dacos will kick his fourth, and he does. 23 kicks McGuan. Dacos. <laughs> strength. Strength and use of the body. Well done, Peter Dacos. It was a skill. great effort. The skill is unbelievable, this bloke. Just a little bit of magic he weaved there and then set sail and drills it through well that makes the hair stand up on the back of the head Collingwood well, have got loose men everywhere on the forward line Banks is by himself in the pocket as Russell runs in handball over the top Dacos is this his sixth it certainly is Collingwood fans are ecstatic it was all Collingwood forward of the ball Mullane in short for Dacos who takes the mark so finally he breaks the shackles Peter Dacos will kick from just inside the 50 and Gavin Keane has done so well the former Essendon player stands the mark so close to half time Dacos can he get his first goal crowd likes it kicking with the wind he's brought up two flags out to McGuan where he's got Dacos on the run, beautifully done, saw him out of the corner of his eye. Dacos kicked a goal just before the half-time siren and now a chance to bring up his second. He doesn't miss too many like that. One goal. Leslie up one-handed, Kennedy has to try to beat two, Banks is in there. Dacos oh, gets into some open space pretty easily and goes for goal and gets it. Peter Dacos putting through his third goal of the afternoon. Players today. Handsomely defeated Scotty McCarver in the first half. Dacos in front. Again in the pass. A good strong grab though by Dacos out in front. He'll be lining up for his uh, fourth goal. Which he should get from there. He hasn't missed too many that far out. And he hasn't missed this one. Those banks kick short. Russell knocks the ball down. Manson, is this his third? Dacos will make it run, no doubt about that. Dacos' his first goal. Kicks long. Inside 50. McEwen comes out. He uses that large body of his. Hocking had the ball and then lost it just as quickly. Morgan, a hurried hand pass. Bowen bounces once, twice. Won't get that. Dacos snaps. Snaps truly for a goal. Oh, there's danger. Tony Francis gets onto that loose ball, onto the left foot, hooks it back to Dacos. He's had a free kick, yes, holding the man. 
That was well positioned by uh, Dacos. He positioned himself very, very well. We might get a shot of this. In just a moment, and you'll see how good he was at positioning himself. Peter Dacos from directly in front. Slams it through for a goal. So the Magpies hit the front. Justin Pickering has gone wide. Oh, well done, Darren Mullane. He was the only one who really wanted that ball then as he kicks in front of goal. Up the ground. Here's Dacos. Step to goal. Yes. Oh, oh great play, Peter, Peter Dacos. He kept on in the last quarter and brought up his 50th goal for the season. It, bounce. it does. Look at that. There's a rev up then, thinking they might have been just uh, taking it a bit casually to centre half forward. Manson in the front spot. Cloak, oh, Dacos, brilliant. Kick a goal, Dacos. You deserve it after that, and he does. It was a gem. 14 15 to 14. And getting goals at that non scoring in. Malone, of oh, very good skills, goes back to Shaw. Shaw's right foot kick is high, bit of an up and under. Mark the Collingwood, taken by Dacos. 30 metres, maybe a little bit further from goal. Difficult angle, breeze blowing from the right. Oh, what a great kick. What a magnificent kick. Held up, Barwick gets there first. Thumps a left footer down towards the forward pocket. It bounces through the pack. in front, breaks away from Rance who infringed, free kick was going to be paid, clever kick, Dacos marks. Was that a clever kick or a miss kick? I think it was meant for Brown wasn't it? But it fell short. I think it was supposed to be a centre. This could be his third. He's kicked Collingwood's only two goals and now he's got three out of three. There Tony Shaw, Scott Russell, both of their very very good possession gatherers. Rance has bumped out of it. Here's the mercurial Peter Dacos. If he kicks a goal here, the crowd will go berserk. Great on. Kicks it to within scoring distance for the Magpies. Christian. There's a goal coming up. Dacos will get it. Oh, brilliant play. Far forward. Collingwood with a chance to score. Bowen. Seconds left. Gafer. A little pass is a beauty. Dacos has the chance to get his sixth goal for the day, and it'll probably be the last score. That was a good kick by Gafer. We wouldn't have seen Gafer show that skill a couple of years ago. Compliment to Gafer, Michael Gafer, that he's really worked on that side of his game. Dacos, beautiful kick by Dacos, straight through the centre. And Peter Dacos gets his sixth goal right. of Peter Dacos, the kick into the pocket, Carlton should rush it over the boundary line, they don't, Collingwood may get a goal, Dacos, into an open run and he kicks it, Dacos kicks the first goal of the match, Manson, Richardson, who's got some space, one bounce, can have another if he likes, drop punt to the goal square, Dacos and Blackwell, Dacos, occasion the flight of the ball, Fancied Dacos. Drop cut through the middle. Dacos has got two on the half volley. Mullane. Collingwood love it at the moment. McGuan charges to centre half for Dacos. Oh, it's champagne footy. Well, there's plenty of room for those car Collingwood forwards to move. And Mullane's just given a roving position across centre. He might try a torpedo here, he does, and thumps it, look at that, it's home! Almost, Rennitz, Dean, on the up, Blackwell, caught by Dacos, and again the numbers, Banks, Brown, Dacos, and this will be a goal. Dacos has kicked four, comfortable mark. Plays on, just chips it towards Herman, but Wright's got it. And look at the rebound now. Dacos on the lead. Look at that. Chess, Peter Dacos. Drop punt. Look at that again. Five.
Not today, boss. What are you looking for? Dacos. I wonder if he'll go to the big torpedo punt kick here. Well, he let one fly last week, didn't he? Yeah, let's have a look. No. Goal of the week, actually, that kick. Uh, drop punt. Hasn't been amongst them so far today. This for his first. From 52 metres. Distance won't be a problem, neither will accuracy. Plays on to McGuan, who's still outside 50. Takes his kick, long towards Dacos at the back. Well, he's been relatively quiet today, Peter. Has kicked one goal, that was in the third term. But the chance now to add to that. Well, when you've got the sit like that, there's nothing the back man can do. And he makes no mistake. This is Banks. Banks hooking it back. Christian and Dacos. And Dacos marks. Dacos has kicked two. He's been well held today by Michael Kennedy, but you can't keep him down all day. He's too good. And that was an excellent mark as Dacos, sorry, Don, the kick. It's close. It's a goal. Peter Dacos. Third. They've got the game. Barwick is now on the back line. Long drop punt to the goal square. Dacos. Oh, doesn't he do it well? And he kicks the goal. The magician at his top. It's 1-5 to 4-2. Two. two kicks and Collingwood have had a lot of quiet players. Christian to the half forward. Well, what's happened? There's something going on at half forward. It's Dacos and Eppleston. And up by giving the free kick. And when the video was viewed, it was a little bit different. But Peter Dacos from 45 metres, the Collingwood champ. It's close. It's a goal. The Magpies fight back. Now to McGuan. McGuan thumps at the full forward. McEwen. Wine. Makes a mistake. Takes forever. Oh. McEwen. Caught. Dacos goal. Left foot puts it through. Hollywood is back. It's 10 18 to 13 9. Collingwood's loose man game, cutting them to ribbons at the moment. Good block by Harding. Dacos, always dangerous. Snapshot is brilliant for a goal. But I think his own man hit him. Barwick, one of the longest kicks in the competition. Good punch away. No, not by Taylor. Dacos marks right on 50. To start with, they had that ball to drop to his chest. And he's kicked one, Peter Dacos, from right on the 50-metre mark. Good-looking drop punt. That's his second. Christian, too much pace below then. Then the left foot pass is a ripper. What a great pass by Christian on the left foot to Dacos. Will he go to the torpedo punt? Now, the crowd will await. Yes, he is going to torpedo punt. Have a look at it. A brilliant kick by Dacos. A 65-metre <laughs> kick right through the middle. Well, you picked that one, Pete. Oh, you can bet on it. As the base of the pack, a quick hand pass comes out the keys. Dacos. Well done. Of course, when the ball comes in quickly and short. Dacos for goal number four as he kicked it. Yes, he has. And right is off and running. And they got a forward to capitalise. Gavin Brown comes out in front. Hamilton hot on his hammer. Over the back is Dacos. Can he kick a goal, Peter Dacos? Yes, he can. Attacks the goal with a good kick. Airs back, Dacos round his body, and at long last he's got one. Brown on the up, McGuan, Richardson round his body, Dacos. The beautiful kick to 74 this season. He did kick 76 one year when he was the leading goal kicker at Collingwood. He's been twice leading goal kicker. 74 this year, drop punch. He's kicked that well. It's a beautiful goal. Russell having an absolutely outstanding match. And Dacos will mark it. From 40, drop punt. Straight through the middle. On that half forward flank, kicks it long in towards centre half forward. Taylor, oh brilliant football. McGuan. Dacos into an open goal, and it's precision football by Collingwood. Play anywhere, half back, half forward, real sweeping roll. 
Gee, that's pretty ordinary football. Will Dacos make them pay for it? I think he has. Yes. Fairly doing the ruck work. Stasevic, Dacos, shot for goal by Dacos, and it's good. Into right. Kick by right, right to the edge of the goal square. Dacos. Just a class above them. Should be a gift goal. Deserves it. His second. Then our forward. No mark. Stasevich. Rucks clear. Kick to full court. Dacos. Oh, he was looking to get away from Smith that run into the open goal. It's kick two. He has now kicked three. Possession. Out to Morwood. Here go the pies again. Dacos. Well, Peter Dacos. It's just the perfect skilled player. Eyes on the ball all the way. And that ball had Dacos number 35 written all over it from about 35 metres away. Taylor stands on the goal line, but I think you'll watch this go over his head. Dacos. Beautiful kick. Four goals for the match, three for the quarter. Taylor out the back door, Francis pulled down his right. Now it's Dacos, and he'll take the free kick, Chandler, the offender. Quickest way to get it back to Longmire is to bounce it in the middle after the goal. Dacos for his fifth. Looks pretty good from here. And scoops up, 55 metres out, short pass for Stasevich. Dacos, the crumbs, Bryant is the umpire, go Dacos! Six to Peter Dacos. He's got a panic to move in, passes from still inside the square, Ransom Taylor, and Taylor showing some toe on Walshroll, who dives on top of it, similar situation to Vanapik, Dacos, going forward is right, he doesn't let him down, barely the required distance for a mark, right kick, and up and under job, Dacos back position well, Goes back, snaps up, that's good. First goal of the match. Boyle. He lands at the right half back flank, kicks to Stasevich. On the right, oh, too quick for him. Not on the boundary line, gets around Pios. Square Christian Dacos loves these and he kicks it. 
for. There's an opportunity for the Magpies. Christian to right. He can go goal with Dacos is on over the top. Dacos 25 metres out, settles and gets it. That's his second. High drop punt. Dacos and Warsfold. Great mark to the magician. And he's kicked two. 45 metres out. Drop punt. And that's his third. So Christian over the back of Langham. Warsfold's hip and shoulder on the ball. The Dacos snap. What a gem. Well, not much in that, as you can see. Banks to the half forward line. It's thumped the ground. That was Anderson trying to crash his way through the pack. And now Price pinned him for holding the ball. Well, at least they've been consistent, haven't they, the umpires? We might not agree with that interpretation of the rule, but they're consistent. And you've got to move the ball on. We'll watch this on replay. Anderson going through. Well, really didn't make an attempt to no. get rid of the ball. Tackled by two Collingwood players. Peter Dacos with a free kick from 45 metres. This will lift the roofs off the stadium as he kicks and goals. With a set shot on his left foot. Salmon and Stasevich. In they go after in front of the Collingwood goal. They wouldn't want to let Dacos get it. They do. Peter Dacos on the left foot. their fresher Collingwood Tony Francis hooks it up in front of goal Dacos in front can he do something magical yes he can put his body in front and bang he took it and look at the Magpie supporters well it's Dacos and Shaw they're the only two players that have played in a grand final side they played together in 1981 kicked by Dacos it's a goal Paddling it towards himself, the pressure's too great. That's exactly right, Ian. It's a one-grab game today. Boundary throw in, up over the top, Stasevich. No one can break clear. Attack to the advantage of Dacos. Look at the gather. The right foot snap. This is a miraculous kick. picks it up, heads in towards the pocket over the head of Thompson it goes Dacos, this is where he's at his best the master that is all it takes well that's his second goal and his first was a miraculous goal and that was miraculous as well now watch this here he is behind Thompson, he picks it up, now it's on his right foot, he's more or less got his body side on, he puts it across his body and kicks with that, amazing. This is it this time, Francis the hand pass to Tudden, bouncing ball for Dacos, on the turn, thank you very much Peter Dacos. No, sorry, Collingwood free kick and it's coming back to Francis, he takes it from the circle, up towards half forward, Dacos, and the captain, the acting captain today takes the mark. Breeze has died down since earlier on. Left to right from there. Not a lot of effect on this kick. Dacos for goal from 40 metres. Gets the Pies' first goal. They're well covered on the forward line, the Magpies. Fork to Dacos. There's the free kick to Peter Dacos in the back. And have a look in replay. Front position. Push right in the middle of the back. No doubt about it. And Dacos very rarely misses. So ready kick one. We'll kick from about 45 metres. Slight angle. And he kicks right through that oh. one. The goal umpire did not move. Goal. That's where he came from, Glenn Rowan. Peter Curran off and uh, David Bain on, Drew. Glenn Rowan, town of another famous Kelly. And Craig Kelly does go by the nickname of Ned. Sometimes he plays it a bit like a bush ranger. I reckon. Peter Dacos from 50 metres out. What a kick for goal. A sensational kick. A boundary line job. 
terrible option that from Maloney. Yes, uh, when you make a mistake, don't make it a short one. Here's Dacos. Kennedy. Good skills, Kennedy. Francis Dacos. Goal. Get it down quickly. Williams to centre half forward. Dacos tries a one hander. A free kick yep. to Dacos. If he gave the top, I wonder. The torpedo punt is 45 metres out. Uh, it looks like a drop punt. So, Dacos, will he kick a captain's goal at half time? High drop punt. He has. He's put it through. A sensational end for the first half. Collingwood 4 11. Trail Footscray 9 goals 6. The bounce. Lands with Turner, turn of the chip pass, some strong work. Well played, Alexander. Back cross, back. And again, the margin is three goals and three goals to Dacos. Can't afford that now. The short pass is on. Dacos, can he get there? Yes, he can. A brilliant mark. Kick to Dacos' advantage, but it was still a brilliant mark. And that ground. And Dacos will have a shot from about 45 metres out. He doesn't normally miss these, Peter Dacos. Sits back, bang, right through the middle, ball to Dacos, he's fourth. Comes to Tottenham, danger for Fitzgray again. Oh, loose men for Collingwood, Kelly. He's got two men back in the square if he gives it over. Another goal coming up to Dacos, he's bit. Bang, and that plays career in the way. Opportunity for Tottenham. Penetrating kick. Dacos is one out with Waterman. Great mark. Marvellous mark. So hard to beat in that situation. Peter Dacos. And what a, sorry, Dennis. I'm just going to say what a difference direct football makes. Tottenham bursting through the centre of the ground there and kicking it long to Dacos in the forward line. Dacos, unlikely to miss. He has it. Field. Coming up field will be uh, Russell. Russell booting the ball in towards centre half forward. Dacos cleverly outmaneuvered his opponent, took the mark using his body well, pivoted around, and he's marked about 45 metres out directly in front of his adoring fans down there on the Sharon stand. The score Collingwood a point, Fitzroy yet to score, and Peter Dacos chance to kick a goal coming off the 50 metre line now the distance is no problem whatsoever it's swung back and by the look of the goal umpire this time it is a goal and Collingwood backing up he's still on the half forward line on the outer side kicking up towards the railway end and his kick has found Dacos I'm not prepared to say he kicked it to Dacos but the kick found him what did you think Ron? Uh, quite correct I think it's a bit of a fluke kick it meant to be kicked towards the goal then. Dacos has taken the mark come around on the mark and he's kicked it through and uh, that four points, uh, Dacos' second goal. Collins centre wing on the uh, outer side of the ground by sheer strength and speed. Mullane burst away from Gale, had a bounce and then hooks it into wood. That's beautiful football, Mullane. If we had such a thing as play of the day, that'd be it. And he gave it to Dacos, who's been kept pretty well in check uh, by uh, Lyon of Fitzroy. In fact, Dacos, who's marked at 25 metres out. Angle not uh, very much to speak of, and he tops it off with a goal on the throw to Bruce and over vitamin scoreboard. Centre square, Dacos gives him a lead. The kick to Dacos, and an excellent mark, brilliant football. Burke all over the top of him, but Dacos uses the body beautifully, waits for the last second to commit himself to the football, and takes the mark. And the man who kicked 97 goals last year, from 30 metres out, and puts it through. Forced it down, but uh, Shark by the Rover, uh, Shaw kicks up with his wrong foot towards half forward. Gastek gets a bad bounce, a good one for Dacos. Lines up, the breeze will bring it back and down. Collingwood will eventually get the goal. Dacos kicked it. Away from Champion, straight down to his skipper, who pinpoints Dacos, who marks 55 metres out from goal. Gets a push in the back from Campbell, and the crowd say, what about 50? He goes for the big torque, Dacos. It's going to land up in the left forward pocket. Oh, Mark Richardson should have marked it, but he does retain the ball. Picks it up, kicks into a Brisbane Bears player. Dacos has got the goal and has put it through for a goal. Dacos has put it through. Three seconds. Fine star speech on the attacking side of the centre. Plenty of time to look for Dacos in front of Ryan and Marks. 40 metres out directly in front. 
and the pleasantries forgotten of uh, some half a minute ago as Dacos beat uh, Ryan. Kicks for goal and the Pies in front by two points. Collingwood. Starsevich has got it and a very doubtful free kick that one but Starsevich will kick from 55. And a high floater right up into the goal square. Can someone take a mark? Dacos, the dangerous Dacos, a quick hand pass. Brown lying on top of it. Manson, Dacos around the corner, hooks it back, it looks good. Great goal. Clean possession. Comes back to it. 50 metres out. Won't make the distance. Dacos! Well, it takes the class of Dacos to get the pies back into it. And how many times have we seen it over the years, Drew? When the game's in the balance, Dacos produces that something magical. Peter Dacos, his third kick only for his second goal. Forward line, over the back of Starsevich. Will it sit for him? No, it's socket off the ground. Oh, an indiscriminate kick has landed in the hands of Dacos. But the value of playing in front and attacking the ball, Peter. Exactly, and Dacos in front, and they need this one, Collingwood. He's only had four kicks. Peter Dacos kicks a goal, a magnificent kick right through the middle. That's his third. Francis, pace, on the left foot, brings it in towards full forward, Kelly, over the back, Dacos versus Hockey, Dacos Hockey, oh yeah, showed superior pace in Hocking. dangerous here though, Dacos from the boundary, oh an amazing goal, well what about that? Tackle on Buse was a pretty quick Manson's handball to Francis, Francis with a snap, Dacos got it, just inside the line. Well, a normal man would be uh, odds against, but he's odds on to kick this. It's through. He's a freak. No question about that. Reminiscent of that goal in the grand final in the first quarter. 3-2 three, to 3-4. Three, to come in and bring it back towards half board. Manson sets himself. Good mark. Off he goes. Dispossessed. Good play that by Darcy. Darcy still on oh, the dangerous take off an open goal. A goal. Mr. Magic has kicked his third. Thanks. Brown able to find some space. Can go all the way here, Brown. Goes for the chip the day, Cos gets him. Dacos with three goals. And this is a steadier Collingwood want. Ten points of difference. And he's got his fourth. Williams, McEwen, surely for Turner. Short pass to Dacos, and he marks. Just eight. Done, and that's why he's been a champion, he is. This is possession number eight, and Dacos gets his first goal. Didn't get too much at ease off the left boot, did he, Dennis Banks, then? Lawrence wins this. Last, last minute goal for the Pies, Dacos. Gets a sight of him and kicks it. Oh, amazing years. 13 to 15, 12. Dacos kicks the back of the ball. He's a freak. Ball comes across the wall to Ritsky. Well tackled by Barlick. In goes Dacos. Beautiful play by Dacos. The one-handed pick up back of the arm. He's got players everywhere to try to go for goal. McCartney and uh, in fact Moore has been moved on the German. Dacos in the centre square kicks the Magpies up to half forward through comes Barwick. The ball spills taken by uh, Joel. Well tackled by Banks. In goes Tony Shaw working hard. Attempted to kick away by, by Mark. Dacos has got it again. He's outside 50. He's going to pick another one. He goes for 50 metres. being uh, brought back on the mark. He went for distance with the kick. Awkward looking cut. This could be another goal if it sits up for Manson. Oh, he can't oh. pick it up. 
like a piece of soap. He goes for the hand pass. Dacos loves these. Snaps and gets it. 18 years of age, Paul Williams. And, of course, we've got Jason McCartney. Here's Dacos. Oh, look at the magician there. At work. Seven. 22 minutes gone in the third quarter here at Victoria Park as Wine gets the ball down towards Cameron. He tapped the ball further into play, picked up by Cameron, got a little kick away, just rolled with the tackle, kicked it forward, and there's the man that Collingwood put their hopes on. Peter Dacos just standing at the edge of the 10 metre square, took the very simple mark as the ball dropped short, and Dacos will put this through, and Collingwood will hit the front for the first time to go. Dacos puts it through. He handballs it off to Lehman. Lehman down towards the full forward line with a floating punt. Awkward to mark. It goes over the top of Rick Kennedy. Dacos after it. He soccered it in midair through towards the goal. And Dacos has put it through. Typical sort of miracle stuff from Dacos. And foot spray undone again. Down round by throws it in. And Keenan Reynolds goes up and taps it straight to Dacos. And Dacos turns around and swings it through for another goal. And Peter Dacos has got 3-1 or 3-2 on the board today. And Brown then kicks it up towards Morwood. Scott Wine went in, went in one-handed, couldn't take the mark. Doubles back on the ball now, gets the handball away, but it's into a wall of players. Tudnam's the man out with the ball. He gets a handball to Dacos. Dacos finds space where others wouldn't. Winds up the goals and he puts it through. Magic play by Dacos. Just a pure bit of class there. Put it through for his fourth goal to make the league very comfortable for Collingwood. Four. Confidence, Djakovic went back to Turley, but they paid the price. Mullane gives it to Francis on centre wing. He kicks down to half forward. Five seconds remaining. Needs a mark here, and he's taken it. Dacos doesn't want to play on. They play against Turley out in the outer side for botting like that. And they allow that. So I mean, there's a contrast there. Both are allowable. Two umpires, different interpretations. The siren's gone, so this after the siren for Peter Dacos. Good looking kick, too. It's home. Collingwood get their seventh goal. Dacos his first. And a three. So the ball's sticking today. It's not greasy. We did have a light shower here around about half past one. Dacos again, second mark, almost as spectacular. I'm sure you to retain his footing. Dacos kicks a goal and gets between centre and centre half forward. Now he plays on, kicks it in the pocket. Dacos has got five metres. Dacos that's uh, kicked most of the Collingwood score after this kick. 
Drop punt kick. Looks pretty good. He's happy. Peter Dacos. Not paid. Russell. Morewood. Kicks from outside 50. Dacos in front. Yes, and takes the mark. Only place is in front. For his third, directly in front, Peter Dacos. He doesn't miss those. He hasn't missed that one. Fight is there for Collingwood. Back inside 50. Short pass. Dacos has got it again. He's doing well, Graham Wright. Really got that ball going down out of the back line earlier. How does he get on his own, Don? Well, he's a very elusive player. And there's player. his man tackling Wright. That's why he's by himself. That was Dean Rice. Dacos shoots for goal and puts it through. Brown again. Shaw. Out to Francis. Fleet of foot. Kicks long. Up towards full forward. Oh, the mark fumbled down there by Rice. Dacos off the ground. Gets going in the foul. The mark. Now Russell. Big Manson. Scoops it quickly to Russell. Dacos and Rice. A little nudge again. He got penalised for that earlier. Not this time. Dacos has kicked 5-1. He's now kicked 6-1. Oh. Francis round onto the left foot. Kicks it to within scoring distance. Dacos has got it again. Difference between the two teams is this magical person here. Number 35 for Collingwood. He has these days occasionally, doesn't he? Oh, he's a champion. And look, he doesn't make any mistake. Play on quickly. Keeping the forward line open. Dacos will be there about. There he is. Gets away from Spud Frawley. Kicks a goal. Looks like number eight. The goal umpire says, yes, sir. Just away was by Lewis. Here's Paul Williams, the Tasmanian. In towards goal. Dacos. Goal. Great play of the Magpies. Now he wants Dacos. Zanotti wearing him like a glove. And it's a free kick. It's gone against him. Oh, a very lucky free kick I think you'll find here. Oh. However, he has the football. And that is what counts. From 40 metres. It's a lovely looking drop part of his goal. So Poot. Darren Mullane throws it over the line. And the ball comes straight to Mullane. Ducked in the boundary line. Pulls it in with his left foot. Oh, was it not? He went to fly it away, and it's Dacos at the back. As well, he's in the top tackles, and the top kicks, and the top hand passes. He's in, he's in everything. Morewood called for it long. That's where it went. Overrun by Lewis. Dacos a chance from 30 metres. This is where he can bend them back so dangerously and so well, and he's done it again. That was brilliant. Doug's marketing's up and running. The lead is on. Dacos versus Zanotti. Brilliantly done, Dacos. Can he kick another one? He rolls it in towards goal. <laughs> Five goals, Peter Dacos. Brilliant exhibition. <laughs> Over Morwood's head. He's first to recover. With him is Brown, and with him is Malone. Darren Malone, a stab to Dacos. Oh, they're warming to the task now, yeah. Pete. Plays on, Dacos. Oh, oh look at that. Six goals to Peter Dacos. And, uh, plays on. They're a light now. Mullane in the pocket. Across the face of goal. Dacos and Gaste. He gets a kick. Don't tell me he's kicked that. I will not believe it. <laughs> Gavin Krasiska runs and kicks long. He's a chance for a mark at the back. Gastiv right underneath it, no judgment. Dacos, superior judgment there. Superior positioning of his body. Kicking the goal number eight, the Collingwood champ puts it through. So Away they go again. Up towards half forward. Starsevich up with the hand. Dacos at the back, ambles into goal and pops through yet another one. What's that, nine, Pete? Yes, I agree. That is a shocker. Francis to the pocket. Dacos oh, really grabbed it again. Oh, there we go. Yes, yes. <laughs> Goal number 10. Yes. yes. Great performance by the Magpie champ. So looking for the hand pass. Morewood again. Oh, Dacos. taps it on Dacos. Oh, oh free kick. kick. Dacos. He's kicked 10. Goal number 11 about to come up, I would think. No doubt about 11. 11. I'm running out of paper here. Well, here he goes. Let's see. He shouldn't miss this. He kicks, no doubt about that, right through the middle. Well, 11 goals to Peter Dacos. Right, claimed by Ashcroft. 
Tudnam towards full forward. Dacos at the back. The shepherding. Can Williams pick it up? He can now. Off to Dacos. And bang, there is number 12. Right. The lead is on Dacos. Oh, good attempt to mark. Free kick. Dacos. I guess Boyle was on. Well, let's have a look at that. Did Dacos have Campbell's arm? Well, here he is, Peter Dacos. Goal number 13, and it's home. Brilliant exhibition by Peter Dacos, and the Magpie supporters salute their champion. Can he's the Piece of the body. Yes. The short one is onto the pocket. Dacos! Good pass by Tony Shaw. That's better because the long... ...the mark on replay. He's taking a, a better run in this time, Russ. Three or four steps. There's the kick. Beautiful style. Goal to Dacos. Dacos. Well done, Ops. Dacos. Don't tell me. Don't tell me yes. Well, anything Alan Jakovic can do, I can do as well. Dacos is the leader's on. He leads to the pocket. Obst, a push out, was it? No, play on. Dacos. Oh, great goal by the Collingwood magician. Viney gave it up. Francis, round the body. Dacos. Well, he and Djakovic have gone goal for goal today. Dacos with three, Djakovic four. And you back Dacos from here every time. And he's put it through. Four to Dacos. Stretch falls over. Williams takes him on, gets around and kicks it to Dacos. And now he normally kicks these. Watch this one for Peter. Another Dacos gem. With a little one to Dacos. Fantastic pace from Graham right there. Francis had the ball about 15 minutes in front of him, right ran past him. This is the way Dacos likes to kick them. Make it number six. Well, Manson, three marks, three possessions. Gets it wide to Brown. Free kick to Dacos. Nothing doing. Peter Dacos! Ma magic by Dacos. His first kick. Too far out to score. Goes looking for Dacos. Three. Oh, clever man. Have you ever heard a roar like it? He plays on and kicks a goal. And that as well. Good kick by Lehman into the breeze. Dacos stays down at the back. It's knocked away by Keyes. Here's the magician near the boundary line. 30 metres out, Peter Dacos. Three kicks, three goals! Well, they don't come any better than that. That is one of the goals of the season. He'll fickle bounce there for Mullane, taken by Turner, dragged off it. Walker was in there too. It comes across to Russell. Russell goes wide intended for Dacos. Dacos, what can he fashion this time? This should be easy. Outside of the boot. Another one. Here go the pies again. Stasevich to Dacos. <laughs> the crowd calling talk. Talk, talk, talk. They want the talk. He won't need the talk. Steer this through with a drop punt from about 48 metres. It's home. Paul Williams quickly back to Gavin Brown, who runs through the centre, off to Grosisco. Positive thrust by Collingwood, down towards Dacos and Hockey. Dacos got a hand on it. Oh, he controlled it beautifully, and he's done it again. Come to an end. Malayne. towards full forward, McEwen from one end of the ground to the other as Ross said back to Dacos, the miracle man needs to work something here and do it fast there's one goal back for the Magnets through to Watson, from the 50 centres for Dacos, you're in trouble Higgins whatsoever, and Peter Dacos as you can see, swallows that easily, and an easy shot at goal Kicked only one last week, but he's kicked one today. 14. He's had about 15. 
possessions in the first quarter. It's good coaching by Bacchanal with Brunton. He's got one dangerous. Dacos, a freak! A magnificent goal by Peter Dacos! Never penalised. Now the short one is on. Watson up in front. Couldn't quite take the mark. Chance for Kepler to try and get it out. The dangerous Dacos. What can he do? He runs to the boundary line, hooks it back, and slams it through for a great goal. It was an emergency. Replaced Tony Francis in the selected side. A great kick to Dacos. We may see Magpies winning by a big margin in the finish. Going for number four, Peter Dacos. Look at that. Most mistakes at the moment, Ross. The players out there or the men officiating. Here's Dacos from the pocket. Well, you'd expect that. Goal. To the pocket, no mark, certainly touched by the earlier player. McEwen to Christian, and Christian well done. Summed it up on his non preferred side. And a chance to get Collingwood's eighth goal. Dacos, what a wonderful kick, no mistake. Dacos' first pass, it gets And Collingwood through for system will go for it. forward, road taps down, Dacos, can he make it another one? Watson tried to take the mark, Russell, covering more ground than the early explorers, took it away. It in the heart wards half forward gowers at the back the dangerous Dacos here's a goal coming up Peter Dacos around the corner great goal the wards half forward Pert could have edged out a chance for Stasovic to push it along and Shaw Allen intercepts Lehman does it nicely they could get one here they could start something Dacos has just kicked one and he's now kicked another back come the pie over the long kick in towards full forward Watson and Gowers Watson out in front and he breaks the tackle he brings it into full forward Dacos and Morrissey Morrissey did it well but the brilliant Dacos has got it around the corner goes Dacos Peter Dacos is gold again it's come a light in this quarter three goals way down to half forward someone's going to have to come at him he finds Dacos Collingwood wanting goals badly Dacos lets go with a torpedo punt. It's a magnificent kick! Can that lift the Maggies? What a goal! What a goal! Chance for Tranter. On to Tony Francis. In towards full forward. Morrissey leaves his man. Good mark, Brown. Brown to Dacos and Peter Dacos kicks another goal. Excellent kick. Oh, plays on the day, Goss. Sits, waits, and kicks a goal, as only Peter can. Couldn't take it on the half by there, McEwen, but he backs out of trouble, shoots a long handball, down to Dacos, he's in trouble, drops it, he tries to recover, in comes Rowe, he's trying to lend support, Dacos is out, oh. and the umpire said yes! Without Dacos with a chance to score, and there it is, Collingwood's third goal. The ground, a handball over to McEwen. In turn, he handballs to Russell. He goes short and he finds Richardson. A handball to centre half forward, and Dacos goes bang. Oh. Oh. And he's put it right through the centre for another one to Collingwood. It's taken by Russell. Hand pass over the top, but Ron has been fantastic. Kick into the pocket, magnificent. Dacos. You know, it was great delivery, wasn't it? Because he's normally a right foot kick. Well, within scoring distance, he kicks the goal and he's kicked. 
Stop, turns, turns around, Schwert, bangs it towards full forward. Mickens got back. Good fly from the side by Mordor. Well played to Dacre, surely a goal. Left foot, he'll roll it through. Touch lucky, I think, Peter, there, but a goal. And McGuan bang towards the forward pocket. Maynard and over the top, Dacos will kick this for his second. Colin playing his 178th game. Dacos. Danger here. Real danger. One of the great veterans now of the game. He's played uh, 187 games coming into today. Drifts that across the face. McEwen almost from behind. Dacos in front has kicked it. Gets it away to Russell. Flicks it in towards half forward, but only as far as Trevor Paul, who was off. Yes, he was, was definitely off. off. Dacos steals it. It could result in a goal. To half forward. Turner tries to get it on to Woods. The youngster has it now. Inside 50. A little chip to Dacos. He go over the top, will he? He'll get the free. So Peter Dacos looking for his third. Hinkley had to stop him, but it's going to cost a goal. It has. The ball spills free. Picked up by Woods. Into the pocket he goes. A little too far. Dacos at the back. Can he produce something special here? Let's have a look at this again. This piece of magic will play by Peter Dacos. Tony Woods into the forward pocket. Over the top, Dacos read it beautifully. It looked as if McGraw was going to cut him off, but right on that boundary line, he just produced something very special. One of the highlights of the game, Peter Dacos. He keeps on producing those sort of moments in football. Back to the centre. They are not flukes. That is sheer ability. Five views, straight to the Moncors. That's Tony Woods to the half forward line. Dacos, free kick Dacos. Yeah, just too clever, isn't he, Dacos? He touched, tapped that on, didn't he? Yeah. Bernie knew he was about to be grabbed. He yeah, reads the play so beautifully, he realised he was about to be tackled. Now, will he go to the torpedo punt? This will lift Collingwood if he goes to the big torp and puts it through. Here he goes. Torpedo doesn't quite get on. It might be a goal anyway. Oh, what poor defence by Geelong. Wow. Dacos magical. Just about stretch him. Now Rowe, a drop punt. It's a high ball. And it's coming back. And it's uh, in front of the pack. Picked up by Dacos. Lentwood snapped and put it through. Although I think the umpire might have paid the mark. He has. Kerrison hand passes to McGuan. Who runs on. Hand pass to Dacos. Goes for goal and puts it through. And there is the goal that you would expect from Collingwood. As they plays on by hand, gives it to Tony Francis. Got a backtrack around Lambert. Then goes Longy towards full forward. Rocker is there. One grab, not the second. Off the pack, Dacos. Kicks it up. And has put it through. Silver in the ball. Yes, he's kicked it. Between wing and half forward. So Collingwood setting it up. A centering kick by Brown towards half forward. Rocker up one hand. Not the, no, he couldn't mark it. Kick off the ground by Dacos. who was being held and will get the free kick. Or further away from goal. And was marked by Monkhorst. But uh, Dacos was being held obviously. So from 40 out he leans back. And the breeze brings it back beautifully. And he's put it through for another Dacos goal. And that makes number five. Brown. A hand pass to the running Russell. Touches it down once. Kicks long into full forward. Dacos wrestles. Wow. That takes an amazing mark. Now, was it legit? Or did he drag the Richmond player, Lennon, who was in front of him, to the ground? It's been paid. What did you think, Stanley? Oh, I thought it was one of those looting ones there where uh, 
I thought Lennon was trying to hold his ground and uh, Dacos was trying to push back to get in the position and I think that uh, it was a good decision. In the Inside the boundary line, controls the ball beautifully, puts it in front of himself, almost loses his shorts, he's got it, he gives it back to Dacos. Dacos goes for goal, off the outside of his foot and puts it through for his seven. Oh, it's amazing. That sheer jealousy. He looked at Rocker get six and went, I'll get this one. There was no mark taken. Kennedy, late, hurt. She did move right up the ground. Dacos has the mark. And another miraculous effort by Peter Dacos here. I think I've played. So Dacos still for the first goal of the night. Kicks from right on 50. That's home. Number one. And this is uh, number one was a bit bloodied in the first half. Gee, that's got to be a free kick. You got that one right in the mouth, it would seem. Should be two goals, three from there. He wouldn't miss too many from that distance out, and he hasn't. Of course, that error from Stephen Fuckett. Graham Wright taking the free kick. Dacos had a lead in marks. Now, when he go for his torpedo, he'll try the drop punt. When he pass it, plenty of options open for him here. Probably close enough to pick a torpedo up in the RSA Creek from about 45 metres. Goes for the drop punt. And gets the goal. In the third quarter, increased their lead. Kicked off the ground by McClucket. Mr Magic, Dacos, should run in and score a goal and does. Great football from the magician. Listen, a knock on from Rowe. Rocker, he was nearly interfered with by Champion. Well, Gastrim's taken him down. Dacos, another one, and a goal. This is in that position. He's kicked three already. Over to McGuan, who went up one hand and couldn't take the mark. Dacos gets taken out of it. Free kick going Collingwood's way. And it's doing pretty well in that regard at the moment. And Peter Dacos will take, I think, only his second kick for the night. Yes, what's a look at this in replay. Umpire seeing, uh, well, Peter Dacos pretty good at uh, making the umpire notice things, Pete, isn't he? He's got the kick and kicks the goal. <laughs> Lewis couldn't take it. McCartney, who's playing at centre-half back, drives. Well, there's nobody home for the Pies. It's a foot race now. Rocker, Bays let it slip through. Rocker around the corner. Handballs to the Mercurial one. And Dacos pops through his second. Only three kicks to Peter Dacos. He doesn't need many. He's kicked two goals. Away by Flood. Tony Shaw just fumbled. Dacos a chance. Oh, looking for the free kick, Peter Dacos. And he got it. Now, was that excellent use of his body? Or was it ever? He never really took control of the footy, Robbie. Right? Dacos, it was great thinking. Good decision from Dennis Rich. Well, I think he had to pay the free. Uh, Chris Mitchell, I should say, not Dennis Rich. And certainly um, ominous signs for the Bombers with Dacos. This is his fourth kick, and he makes no mistake. By Rowe, he plays on quickly. Handball over the top was too severe for McMullen. He's going to go for Dacos. Can the ball sit? Oh, look at this. Great stuff, Dacos. Collingwood goal. That is just magical. I know it's set for him beautifully, Ross, but take the mark. Here's a chance for McMullen. His kick is not too bad. In towards centre-half forward. The bounce is a little awkward. Hills, Dacos, oh hell, surely a free kick to Dacos, he's yeah. clever, he is clever. The other option Robbo that Kevin Shee's got of course is Werner on the bench who's played full forward if Salmon has to go on the ruck to get some of the loss. Dacos, he shot the goal, he's good, he's kicked his third. Russell, runs lovely Scott Russell, little kick fantastic, Dacos will kick a goal. Beautiful football by Collingwood, Premiership stuff. Collingwood now, they're looking for Dacos, and there he is, he hasn't let them down, number 35, well done by Francis. Finally finishes up with the footy. Peter Dacos, the ball is on its way, and it's there. The kick has been chopped off, picked up by McCartney, McCartney was recruited as a full foot, Dacos, 
Well done, the champion. There's some tendency there on the flank. Williams was asking for the footy from McCartney. He's still saying, you should have given it to me. I was clear, but it's finished up with Dacos. Good use of the body. Free kick even holding on from Collins. Couldn't miss from there, could he? He doesn't. He kicks his second goal. 50 back out towards the wing where Rose got a break on the field. Gets out of a tackle. Then kicks the ball in towards half forward. The ball doubling behind his Dacos. Can he pick it up? He can. Kicks towards goal and puts it through. To attack as Schenko and Stasevic knocked down by Schenko, stolen by Rowe, 40 metres out, the left for kick, they cross his mark just outside the goal square. He's, he's, he's going all right, really and Dacos has. has put it through. Dacos has kicked his second goal, and after 21 minutes, it comes on. M. Attard, we've got one of those at the ABC in our Moscow bureau. bureau. And she even kicks it to McGuan. McGuan, one bounce, runs up the centre half forward, drops it. Gets a sweeping hand pass to Rowe. Rowe's quick hand pass to Dacos. The great man is 25 metres out and kicks a goal number three. Pumps one on to McGuan. The old stage is for Collingwood. McGuan a bounce and then a left foot kick in towards another old stage. And Dacos who takes a screamer. A juggling mark. He was juggling it a third and a fourth time as his body was parallel to the ground. And as he hit the ground, he still magically main, can maintained control of the ball and can line them up now for number four. Tony Shaw, 14 possessions. Richardson comes off and Lehman comes on. And Dacos for his fourth. He really has been the difference. They lead by 14 points. This goal to make it 20, and he's kicked a little bit more than that. He comes in and he puts it right through the middle. Kicked four behinds initially and then kept it off with a beautiful goal. Walker, too far underneath the ball. Dacos has been quiet. Off the ground. Mr. Magic has done it. Oh, what a magnificent goal. Well, you'd say it was a fluke, except he does it too often, Ross, for it to be a fluke. Couldn't have turned his back on the player, I guess, but Hannah has gone back to pick him up. And the player loose down there is Peter Dacos. And he's been pretty quiet today. He's only had nine possessions. One of them was a miraculous goal at this end. He gave McEwen another one at the other end. Of course, he got out of a sick bed on Thursday to take his place in the side. And of course, the plus is that he's taken Silvani out of the game, needing a good man to mark him. From right on 50. The Pies are home. Lost his couple of practice games. You might have seen a game since last winter. I reckon tonight just reaffirms the greatest game of all. Now the umpires picked one up. It's to Dacos, a hand around the shoulder by Reynolds. Well, come on, umpires, you've got to be consistent. You see there, there's a free kick. The Dacos by Reynolds. He has find 25 free kicks a night. Wouldn't you, Drew? Like that? Yeah, yep. In the forward line, Dacos for his second kick only. Kicks a goal. Now Watson brings it in towards full forward. Francisca and Hocking and Barnes with one hand. Dacos clever Bragging. and was held. Oh, Definitely was there. Just grabbed by the jumper. We've got to give him. He made sure he didn't grab it. Very clever for the Dacos from 30 metres. Directly in front. He should kick it. It's off slightly to the right. Did it sneak in? Yes, a goal. Uh, Jared is with Well done by Montfort. A long kick to half forward. Hocking at the back. Thumps at the ground. Dacos has got it. Peter Dacos on the left foot. Oh, have a look at this. What a great goal. It's a little bit slow getting rid of the ball at times. Wilson trying to get Russell to Dacos. In fact, fortuitous uh, recipient on into that lucky kick. Gee, the superstars at both ends of the ground in fine form. Ablett at one end, and Dacos at the other has got three as well. Campbell of the second effort. Lehman bombs it into Dacos. Yes! Strength! It doesn't have any problems on this occasion. Good use of the body. Pushes Stephen Hocking away and kicks a goal. Four goals to Dacos. Dacos, four goals. Can they get another one here? McGuan. Yes, they might very well. Dacos marks. Mansfield's fate's going to be if he kicks a goal in. He 
his equal leading goal kicker on the ground today with four. Has he got that title on his own? He has. Five. Quarter. We're close to ten possessions in that term. Down to Dagos, who's kicked five. And he might make it six now from the boundary line. Loves them from there and gets a miraculous goal. Looking at running, here's Fraser. One of the quickest in their side. Rocker, <laughs> nearly. Number seven, Dacos. If there's such a thing as a typical Peter Dacos goal, that was it. And 20 metres out from goal, tapped down by Handley. The snap of goal, it could be another one. Yes, out of the pack. Yes! Black there. Short kick straight to Starsevich. He lines it up, goes in towards the square. It's a perfect matchup, really. We just spoke about that uh, before we came on air with the uh, Ranganini's the ideal matchup. I think he really is. Day cost two months experience and just a bit of strength as well. Is it going to be the master and the pupil? Day cost goals. The pies away to a hot start. Sneaks away from Kranzberg. He's 70 metres out. Collingwood need the reply. No one able to take the mark. This man can reply. What a champion! By Williams. Williams with a little bit of space. He runs about three metres and kicks at 53. The full force go by. That well, was first touch for the Eagles. And surprisingly, he took it on the chest. And I still believe this man has played an offer from him. Like he can stay yeah. fit and his attitude is right. My well, work, Jared. And he'll kick 60 goals and he's left in that forward pocket. It takes a pretty good player to contain Peter Dacos. He very rarely misses him when he gets a shot, set shot from this position. Signed his contract only yesterday. Kicks the goal. And he's put it through.